Hey guys, welcome back on Astride TV. Jason here, and today we bring you an unboxing and an installation of a phone case. This one's made by Poetic, and it is the Guardian LG made for the v, uh, made for the LG V60 ThinQ. And we have the box here, and this is my current phone right here that we have here. Uh, before we get started, though, like and subscribe if you're new to the channel. It's greatly appreciated. So let's kick it off. We have here my phone. It's the LG uh, V60, and what I currently had on it now for about a, a little over a year now is the OtterBox. Here you can see the slim case, but as you can notice, the rubber or yeah, the rubber material here that has a coating on the buttons here have been disintegrating pretty much and been breaking apart. You can see there. So this 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 did its duty at least for a good year. But after that, it's just basically disintegrated. And this isn't like my first OtterBox either. This is probably the second one that's turned out like this. It's like, I'm not sure what's going on with the materials, but that's what it is. It did its job. But now I found this other one, the Poetic, on Amazon, which I'll have a link down below if you'd like to uh, test it out or use it yourself uh, for your LG V60. And uh, we'll, we'll unbox it real quickly and see how, and install it. All right, here we go. So let's open it up. All right, let's see what we got inside. Here you go, if you wanna look at the sticker one more time. Design in the US, made in China. That's good. All right, nice box, I do like the outline. It reminds me of the the uh, 90s little S thing that you make with the six sticks there, that's funny. All right, cool, so we got two. We got, it looks like this is a, what is it, a frame, it looks like, screen protector. Oh, when you don't need a screen protector, ah, I see. There we go, there's nothing in there, just the frame. And the actual phone case here. We got some steps that looks like installation guides. All right, number one, open from the lower right hand corner. All right, uh, number two, uh, snap to the front. All right, of the phone, got it. All right, enclose the front from the frame back. Okay, cool, installation is not complete. And then you have your guide there with the QR code if you wanna scan it. All right, cool. Flop it open, oh wait, what's on this side? Oh, thank you, nice, okay, cool. Flop it open, here we go. And looks nice. Definitely looks nice. Uh, it says here, let's take this off the back part. There we go. Nice. And it says uh, separate from, from casing. Okay, release here in this corner, I guess, right here. Let's pop it open. Ah, okay, see what they're talking about. Oh, it's okay. There's a riveting, it looks like, around the case to keep it on there. Very nice. Oh, oh, cool. I didn't even notice. It has flaps for the USB port there and also the headphone jack. Very nice. Cool. Okay. Hey, this is kind of difficult to get out. Okay. Well, that's good, though, actually. Let's pop it out. Boom, boom, boom. <sighs> Come on. Okay, cool. And there we go. So that's it. So we got that, that. So it looks like it's a three piece. Ah, I see what, what, what they were talking about now. So this one doesn't have the screen protector, which is fine because my phone actually has tempered glass already, so we don't need a screen protector. And this one does have the screen protector built in, same exact same frame, as you can see. And here is the actual casing. It's clean, very clean. All right, let's pop it out for the installation. Take out my phone, there we go. Very cool. Does its job as a good phone. All right, so first thing we do is we pop the phone in into the actual frame as followed here by the instructions. Where they at? Right there, number two. So let's do that. That was the, yep, that looks right. Yeah, because the, yep, yep. All right, see the guides and everything? The openings for the buttons. Looks clean. All right, cool. Second thing, I mean, third thing right there, basically just put it inside the actual casing unit. So let's pop it in. All right, and then you can see how it just closes up nicely. All right, there we go. And right there, you can see that the USB port is nicely covered, and so is the headphone jack. Very nice. It's clean, and then you have a nice little window here. I guess you could put like any little pictures you want back here to customize it. 
Very cool. Very nice. Let's see. The corners are very well padded. You can see right there. They have very good cornerings. I mean, compared to it is it is larger uh, compared to the Otter Box here. You can see it right there. Uh, let me see if I can put it on top, and you can definitely notice it. Let me see. Boom. See that? It's definitely larger, uh, wider, and longer compared to the Otter Box. You can see it right there on top, sticking out. Bottom sticking out. But it does it feels it feels more heavy duty for sure. And I hope I hope the rubber here doesn't actually wear out as quickly or frequently as the Otter Box. But overall it looks good. I I like it. If I if we do find any issues with it uh, in the future I'll make another video, see how long it lasts and all that. But overall, yeah, it's nice. I it look I actually like this design in the back. You could actually put a nice background or customize it however you want back here which is very cool but yeah you guys this was the unboxing and installation of poetic guardian case for the lg v60 thank you and this came from amazon that's where i found it i'll leave a link down below if you like to test, test test it out or use it on your your lg v60 yourself and again if you like this type of content subscribe it's greatly appreciated I'll talk to you guys later. Take it easy. Bye.